next presentation. Uh, I'm honored to introduce Nima Mogimian. Nima is the Global R&D Director at NanoExplore and today he will tell us about their capabilities and the first Canadian Gigafactory with graphene silicon anodes. Nima, with that, over to you. Thank you very much, Chris, for the introduction. Hello, good morning, good afternoon, uh, if you're in Europe. Um, so today I'll be talking about uh, batteries. So I'll be talking about these guys. So this is a lithium ion battery, a cylindrical cell with graphene anode in it. And I'll be tell you, telling you more about this today, uh, about how we make them. I'll take you on a little tour of manufacturing. Uh, I'll tell you about the benefits and the performance uh, characteristics that we get from these kind of batteries. The, the supply chain, the, the market, how did we get here and what's our big plan for the future? Um, so a key word in my presentation here is a gigafactory. Um, so the word gigafactory or gigawatt hour is something that you quite um, hear when you're following the electric vehicle news or battery news in general. So what it refers to is the gigawatt hour uh, energy. It's the total energy that can be stored in the, in the batteries that you produce in a single factory in, in one year. Uh, and, and why giga? Why, why is everybody talking about gigawatt? hour, not megawatt hour, for example. Uh, there's an old joke in the automotive industry that says, um, you know, if you want to make a small fortune in car business, better start with a big one. And I think the same thing is true for batteries too. It's about economy of scale. You have to get to a certain size that you can become cost competitive and you can really start competing with, uh, with the large manufacturers of batteries in, in Asia. So that's the thing, so I'll tell you more about this. But uh, let's just start uh, with uh, who is making these batteries. So the company name is uh, Wolf Explorer. Uh, so Wolf Explorer is a Canadian company, is a joint venture, 50-50% ownership uh, between Nano Explorer and Martin Rea. Nano Explorer and Martin Rea are, are two Canadian companies that joint forces to make uh, batteries a reality, a batteries production reality in Canada. I'll tell you more about the two companies in about a minute. The first thing I want to show you is a picture that I took a few months ago uh, in our demonstration facility. So here it is. Uh, this is a tray of uh, hundreds of uh, uh, graphene-enhanced batteries. One of the first few batches that they produced in our, our, our uh, demonstration facility in Montreal uh, a few months back. Um, so I was very excited about it, and I took this photo. Uh, so Volta Explore is, uh, is based in Montreal. The demonstration facility of Volta Explore is actually based in, in Montreal. It's about 10 minutes away from Nano Explore, where I am today, uh, which is pretty pretty handy because we had access to the, to the battery lab of Nano Explorer when we were commissioning battery production in Volta Explorer uh, in the middle of the pandemic, which you can imagine with everything closed and so on. Uh, anyway, um, so Volta Explorer is, uh, is, is making these batteries in, in, in Canada, but let me tell you a little bit now about the two companies that basically created Volta Explorer. Um, so Martin Rea, Martin Rea is an automotive manufacturing company, a tier one supplier of automotive parts. Uh, they have more than 16,000 employees across the globe, uh, 57 locations, 10 different countries. Uh, and they have been one of the fastest growing automotive uh, companies uh, in the world with their lightweight structures and propulsion systems, um, you know, taking the market quite, quite rapidly. And Nano Explorer is a graphene company. We are the largest graphene powder producer in the world. According to the report in the, to, uh, uh, of ID Tech X in 2020, we have about 35% of, of global graphene production capacity in the world. We employ more than 400 employees and we have presence in North America and in Europe. Um, uh, with that, uh, I wanna show you our, our graphene facility. This is where I am today. Uh, this is a 4,000 metric tons per year capacity of graphene powder fully automated facility, state-of-the-art engineering. It's actually uh, ISO 9001 certified for manufacturing. Um, and in this facility, we also have a, a very large extrusion facility that is used for making graphene concentrates in plastic, graphene master batches, and also graphene compounds. One of our flagship products in the automotive space with graphene is this brake line tubings that is made from a special compound of nylon and graphene. This is something I talked about last year in the TechLick conference of graphene um, when this was uh, pretty new. Uh, so these uh, 